Sound man kill another one too. Wow, God, everybody, it's your girl Lala. It's your girl Lala. And I am back on your phone, your TV, your tablet, your desktop, your laptop, whatever it is that y'all are watching me on. I'm reading y'all the Bath and Body Works haul. I love, love, love this store. I haven't done one in a while because I just had so much, but I started getting low and I felt like why not just go to the store, grab a whole bunch of stuff, and replenish all my products? If y'all are interested in watching this video, then stay tuned, continue to watch. Don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can be alerted every time I upload a new video. It is day six of my birthday countdown, and I'm hoping that y'all stay tuned and watch every day and bring in my birthday with me. So... Let's get into this video. This is everything that I got from Bath & Body Works. I didn't go overboard. At least I don't feel like I did. Um, But some people might feel like I did. So anyway, this is everything that I went ahead and got. I did buy all this stuff at two different times. So I did save a lot of money. At the end of it all, I saved about 200 and maybe 40 bucks. I basically paid like $80 for all of this stuff. And if you are a Bath and Body Works person, you know how expensive these things are. So basically for all the full size ones, I paid about 350 to 375. And then for the smaller ones, I paid around a dollar 25 to a dollar fifty. Just gonna go through each one and let you guys see exactly what I got and why I picked them. Pink jasmine and strawberry because this smells amazing. It's super super fruity and I just like the bottle. I like the packaging. I don't really eat strawberries but I do love the way that it smells. I got the portolini pink prosecco fragrance as well because this smells more like a grown woman like sexy trying to you know smell good for your man type of thing and then I got the matching lotion to it as well I also got the shower gel but it's in my bathroom right now I picked up the hibiscus guava fresca I love this. It reminds me of like an island smell almost. When I sprayed it, I really wanted to eat it. <laughs> but as we know, it's not a good idea to eat your sprays. And then I got the matching lotion as well. I also got the um, Capri Coastal. Hopefully y'all can see this. I got the Capri Coastal Citrus Body Lotion as well. As well as the shower gel but that is in my bathroom also and that this one smells really fruity really islandy i got the pink chiffon lotion this smells really grown woman too i love that about it because you don't always want to smell fruity sometimes you just want to smell grown and sexy and then i picked up the matching spray another reason why i picked this one up is because i love the packaging sometimes i like the smell but the packaging is what really sells me I grabbed the Cashmere Glow Spray also because it was beautiful and it smells really good. Um, it put me in that whole like vanilla latte, you know, cream coffee type of feel. I also went ahead and grabbed the lotion because for me, the lotion and the body mist are what get me. I don't always get the shower gels or you know the body creams all that extra I just like to have the lotion because it keeps me from being ashy and then the spray to hold the smell on my body as the day goes on one of my favorites I got the mad about you and the lotion as well as the body spray this has always been one of my favorites I don't think I'm ever going to stop loving it the next thing that I picked up is the Iced Pear Margarita. This is really beautiful. And to be honest, if you ever go inside of Bath & Body Works, um, you will see if you open it and smell it or even try like the tester, it literally smells like a pear margarita. Like it smells like you should be opening it, pouring it into a cup, adding a straw, and then sipping it. Like it really does smell exactly how it's supposed to smell. These two right here I already had and it's the... Um, poolside pop body cream as you can see I don't have a lot of body creams because like I said I don't really use them anymore but I will be using this one up just because it's one of my favorite scents and I have the spray as well this is another one that I love the packaging on 
Another one um, that I already had is the Tutti Dolce White Mocha Kiss Spray. I was saving this one because I really love the way it smells, but I think it's about time that I start using it because I've had it for over a year. The next thing that I got which smells bomb as heck is the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Body Mist. And I was so freaking pissed because there were no full size products left so I was stuck with getting the hand cream but that is okay that is okay at least I was able to get the spray and a little hand cream with it some that I already had are the Oahu coconut sunset that I need to go ahead and use if you guys noticed I put the ones that I've had already besides the minis in the front so that I can work my way towards the back and use the older ones first. Another one I already had is the Maui Mango. Dang, I'm trying to get it to focus. The Maui Mango Surf and this smells amazing as well. Cool Coconut Surf. This one smells bomb as well. I had the Honolulu Sun which smells bomb as well. So as you can see, I didn't really have as many as I normally have which is why I needed to re-up. This is one that I, one of the new ones that I picked up is the Twinkling Nights. This smells super sexy as well. It has almost like a vanilla, you know, cream wafer praline type of smell. It smells amazing. Then I have the Wild Madagascar Vanilla. Anything that has to do with vanilla, cream, latte, you know, pumpkin, sometimes cinnamon sometimes like anything of that nature is for me vanilla has been my favorite scent since like high school so i'm never going to get rid of that these right here were in a stocking from christmas so i know they look cute but you're not going to find those at bath and body works but what i did go ahead and get was i got two of the small vanilla bean noels which is my second favorite scent ever from Bath and Body Works and the other one is over here. I got two of the Frosted Coconut Snowballs which is my number one favorite scent from Bath and Body Works and the other one is over here as well. I was so mad that they didn't have the bigger sizes in these right here but I kind of understood why because they're like the best smelling ones. And this has became a favorite of mine, the Cinnamon Apple and Honey. This smells amazing and I grabbed this one with the spray just because I know that I'm going to be doing some traveling soon so these will be perfect to go ahead and throw in my suitcase or maybe like my carry on or my purse and then I did go ahead and get a second set. So all of this stuff came up to about $80 whereas the little minis were like $6.50 almost $7.00 in regular price and all the full size full size stuff runs anywhere from $12.50 to $15 so that is a super super good deal so pretty much that is everything that I got from Bath to Body Works if you guys are wondering if the sale is still going on yes it is I don't know how long it will be going on for altogether but I know that it is still happening right this moment but like I always say Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to mind the business that pays you. And I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.